is up youtube it is your boy quickie here now i have some intriguing news right after the neo like this kind of adds up and kind of doesn't add up but it could happen and it could happen so the playstation or sony i should say owner he's in an interview i'll try to find the interview i think there was an interview that, like the whole there was a clip online i just saw the parts the main parts of it stating he's like they were asking him like oh so you know when this playstation 5 comes out he's like if he's like what he's like if it comes out, I was, I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> like, seriously, dude, he legit said, if. That literally means there could be no PlayStation 5. Is that a smart thing to do? Yo, I have no freaking clue. I'm not an analyst, so I can't necessarily say that. Because the PlayStation 4 is blowing the fuck up. Would you want to stop that? Yes, in a sense, because hardware is getting cheaper and cheaper by the second literally it's way different than what it was 10 years ago because it made sense to make games or i should say consoles in a seven year timeline or span and the whole purpose of a console was oh you have it for five to seven years like it's not a written definition this is just a assumption definition that you have it it's there for five seven years then you upgrade it now obviously like i said times are changing it's totally different we're living in a freaking crazy world attack is getting like cheaper and better every time literally when you get something something oh better already fucking comes out in like a short ass time frame now doing incremental upgrades every three year it seems reasonable it all depends on the person like i would not give a shit i would buy it now can the average gamer buy it again i don't have the statistical data on in my hands does sony yeah they fucking do does microsoft they have billions of data they they fucking got the sony same shit they have the data so they can honestly make an assumption that yo let's just do this with the playstation 4.5 if it works if no one bitches at us freak it let's just keep on upgrading it now does it seem like a pc yeah that's a, again that's a whole different discussion video i wouldn't really want to get into that but this is this maybe again this is a maybe type of thing they're probably relying on many things maybe even vr itself maybe they're looking at playstation vr maybe like yo shit let's see how this does based off of this we'll make a incremental upgrades we'll just make a playstation 4.75 or some shit i don't know well they'll just keep on changing the name and they might end up just making a pc type of thing you just shoving a new ram shoving a new graphic card whatever <laughs> like hard drive like they could possibly start doing that which again it could be a new transition to like, it's basically change and i know a lot of people get scared during change but you know it, it should be a good thing now does this necessarily mean again like i said turning into a pc gaming i don't want to really say yes because it's not really like that it just seems like it in terms of the upgrade but still it's not necessarily in that same sense there's a lot of pc gamers that i personally know of who bought like my friend personally he has bought his uh desktop he made his shit when the fuck did he make his 2009 he can still play almost majority of the good games, like on high settings. Like, not ultra crazy high, but on high settings. I never had a PC game, like PC type thing. Always had shitty laptops. I always played on low or medium. And I'm not even talking about like crazy games. I'm just talking about like regular shitty games. Like Flife, or fucking RuneScape, or Vindictus. Like those regular RPG or Maple Story. <laughs> even those I would play it on low. But again, it's just, it's just a matter of preference. I don't like PC games, so whatever still i feel like it's not going to be like that but let's see how it honestly goes again this was an if and if is a strong word so let us see how it progresses from here on out but let me know your thoughts below guys on this matter what did you guys think do you think this is a smart move stupid move they should you do you think he was just fucking around just for hype i don't know he, he, he doesn't usually necessarily lie and he did say if he didn't say no so let's see how well no no let me know your thoughts below guys but if you like this video give it a thumbs up it helps a lot guys if you're new make sure to subscribe besides that quickie out peace